So this is wild. I'm using the two reference features on my scope, right? Um, anyway. So first I'm looking at, I have to tell you what this is. This is the SCR driver board, obviously, again, for those of you who've been following. And I took readings at the cell. I took readings at the source, so the signal gen. And after the MER and on the uh, rectified positive pulse DC there. So that's what we're looking at here. I've got it stopped. So the first signal here is the gate signal coming from the 10 hertz CMOS signal from the frequency generator. The second, uh, I'll skip that one. Uh, this signal here on the top here is the rectified DC, pulse DC. So there is still some bleed through coming through in that or something else is occurring that is, is, is help sourcing it, I guess, to where it's biasing up and turning on. Yeah, that might be my tuning, but anyway, then the third, the second one down there, the yellow, that is currently what's on the other end of the mirror. So as soon as it comes out of the diode there, where that amp meter's at, that's where my where yellow probe is there. And then finally, the third one down, that is the cell. So that's when I had the isolated probe across the cell. And what do you see there? These aren't, kind of aren't lined up because the reference stayed still over time. But, but, but look at that. Four pulses went in and six pulses came out. Four pulses came in. That was the yep. Yeah, that's the yellow. That's the isolated reading off the cathode of the mer. And six on the third one down, which was isolated across the cell itself. 